What's up, everybody? Brett here, back today playing some more Warhammer 40k Battle Sector. And I've been enjoying this Let's Play so far. I hope you guys have been too. We are headed into the Salt Exchange. Um, That's a pretty uh, ominous title. Hopefully it doesn't make me salty. We spent all of our tokens in the last episode. We got some good stuff. Army management. I just checked that to make sure everything's good. Yeah, let's jump in, guys. Many of the Blood Angels have no affinity for this place, particularly the Primaris. Damn. But I see differently in Kalian's demeanor. He grew from the salts of this moon. The memory of this place flows through him as strongly as his lifeblood. Almost as strong as his guilt. I want librarians so the bad. The Lieutenant does not know that I've been listening to his Vox cast with Captain Martano. Some of my prior famulous habits die hard. Emperor, forgive me. Huh? Indomitus becomes impatient for us to sever this network, as does the Blood Angels' logisticium. The crusade is comprised of millions of people. Their continued presence puts a unique strain on Baal and its inhabitants. The Librarian Dreadnought updates our bearings through this factorum. I will continue to keep an eye on this brother Quindar. He speaks in half-truths at best. Yet our progress is entirely dependent on his ability to scry the synaptic nodes. There is something sinister these blood angels keep from me. They choose their words carefully whenever I'm in earshot. If they did not have the great angel as their sire, I... I would have difficult questions to consider. Interesting. More rift being sown between our uh, our heroes. If salt is the blood of Balfour, then the salt exchange of Kimrinder is its plagued heart. Minerals and sand once poured through its channels, pumping in and out of the whims of merchants and traders. Whatever darkness that has made this factorum its home must be excised and removed completely. Although it does not compare to the original size of High Fleet Leviathan, the Indominus Crusade is an empire unto itself and casts a long shadow over the Ball system. No one dares speak ill of a true son of the Emperor, but Gilliman's continued presence has stalled much of the rebuilding efforts due to supplies being shared between Ball and Indomitus. 1800 army size. That's a new one for us. We should be able to field quite a bit. And I also went ahead and upgraded the ranged weapon of our Dreadnought. I thought I would tell you guys that. We got the melter gun. The core of the synaptic node waits for us here. It's easy to imagine this beating heart of Kemrender alive. Merchants, brokers, thieves. Their minds open pathways for heresy <laughs> and greed. Let us find this synaptic creature and sever it from its network. Anyone who's not wearing power armor. See, I knew I should have looked at this a little bit better. Uh, we could bring a heavier army than this. Like, I could probably bring another Dreadnought instead of bringing an Assault Squad. I'm I'm not going to go back and, and do that, but uh, I would, if you're playing along at home, I would probably recommend maxing out your points. Um, I mean, we'll get a lot more value out of a Furioso Dreadnought than a Battle Sister. I mean, that's just, that's just the way it is. Or even another Land Speeder over something like that. Anyway, we've got some choices here. Once again, it's another big map. kind of split, I mean I'll call it three ways, there's a, a left flank, right flank, and a center. I don't know how much I want to split. This might be one of those good times to try and just push up the center, depending on what our actual objective is. If our objective is to get over here, look at this, I can see like a little purple orb thingy. If our objective is to come here and kill whatever the hell is over here, then I might just want to push up the center and keep ourselves high and tight. Maybe, um, hmm. Just how are we going to do it? Who who runs up the center? Brother Quindar is always up the center. Let's get uh, Tech Marine Kroganax backing him up. Let's get something like this, perhaps. I don't hate it. Aggressor. Aggressor bros out on the right flank. Where are my aggressor bros? There they are. Out on that flank. Let's get Man, I can bring I can bring everything I want. It's so crazy. Let's get our hellblasters here. 
You know what? I like. Mm, maybe a land speeder there. Let's get. Brother Arturo is the real question. I think we put him here. Back that up. Let's get our assault squad plus Lieutenant Carleon on this side. See, the, the thing is, I want range capability on both sides. And, Kate, you know, I'm going to get attacked on both flanks. I already know. So maybe this is one of those cases where I just want to evenly distribute instead of going, like, heavy on one side, heavy on the other. Because the map looks pretty equal. So maybe I do an aggressor on both sides. Could do... Land speeder here. Sister Verity here. Something like this. May as well move him forward. Something like that, maybe. I don't want to get too particular. Something like this. Brother Arturo with the heels. I think this is good deployment. Let's proceed. Victory for the Blood Blades. Victory for Skyfall. Yeah, I worry that I don't have enough, like, uh, heavy metal killers. And by that I mean armor piercers out on the flanks. Uh, but that's kind of why I like to put the Hell Blasters in the center in case I need to sort of send them in different directions. We let's, are the walls. let's do we this real quick. Are the guns. Just kind of scan our flank. I don't see anything. These are termagants. So that's an easy. Their numbers. They will not overwhelm us. It's an easy couple kills there. Alright, Brother Quindar. You're like my uh if we were playing chess, he'd be my knight. First move out. Okay. We are indomitable. We've got so much we can do. Can I see, is there a difference in the weapon? Not that I would notice, I guess. You have the same weapon? No, you've got like a big claw. Okay. Well, I did equip it, so it is different. It's the melt gun. What is the range on this? Optimal 2. Okay. The question is, who's going to de deal with the termagants? And I think it's probably just going to be Sister of Verity. Is soaked in the blood of the unworthy. And that frees up my dreadnoughts, my two predators, to deal with all this stuff in the front. Not to mention Brother Quindar as well. Okay. And we've got a lot of options off to the side here. My fury will be fast. I'm tempted to go super freaking hard here. Anti -grab Maybe that's dumb. Maybe it's not. Let's do the same deal. Let's just look. It. Okay. So I want to go four away from my heavy bolter. On the move. And this will act as a great scout. And I think it will do incredible damage as well. Excellent. And then if I move up even further. Yep. I see you dirty venom thropes. Oh, damn. Alright, I mean, Lance Peter Tornadoes are sick. I am the sword of Sanctuary. That's what we've just learned. We can easily kill this Venom Throat. My new question is can I kill this Venom Throat? That is the new question. And I think the answer is possibly we yes. Are the lords of the assault doctrine. We're just kind of Death a little out of range. Love. If I kill this guy, maybe someone can jump here. All right, we've got that. I think we've got the left flank planned out. I want to get rid of these warriors. The termagants are dead. These are hormigants. A little more annoying. Past, future. There is only service to the emperor. I do want to use my frag cannon. Probably kill one of these hormigants behind cover. Let me move here. I think I'm still short. Yeah, I'm still short too. Moving here would cover that for me. Affirmative. 
We'll do that. Frank bombardment commencing. Nice. Predator crew ready. Rolling Move here. Move here. Tech Marine standing by. Tech Marine. For the Emperor. Move up there. When the day is darkest, we prevail through control. All right, sister, let's go In here. Catherine's footsteps. I'm kind of loath to abandon looking in this general direction. Who tests my conviction? And I probably should be using Battle Sermon. I could have used Battle Sermon here and then moved up my Battle Sisters and Hurt we all would have gotten unclean. bonus damage. Yeah. If she gets kills... In righteous battle, liberation. In death, vindication. If she gets kills, will. then she gets uh, a chance to get an extra action point. The road of righteousness is soaked in the blood of 63, the unworthy. 70. Let's try... You know what? I can frag them. Cut them down. Let's just shoot them. All right. And we'll finish here. Your command. And that'll give me overwatch for this. They shall never walk in the Emperor's light. Now, as far as our aggressors go... Roger that. We're going to put them here and facing outwards. Roger that. Seems good. And the idea is to kind of keep most of my troops in this area. Brother Arturo. We are the sons of Sanguinius. You guys go here. You guys go there. Ranged plasma on your request. Let's go here and go here. We can handle it. And we're gonna see what kind of shots we have with the hell blasters, maybe on these warriors, before we take shots on other stuff. Yeah, that was the only shot we had. So I'll take it. It's not great. Target acquired. Not Mighty terrible damage. Mates. Let's shoot Fire. here. All right, kind of garbage. And we've got two shots here. The struggles of this we can do. creature are futile. Yeah, that sucked. Firing. Yeah, this should be devastating. And that's the kill right there. Alright, that's a lot of models dead. I'll keep an eye out. These are all melee units, so if we set a good overwatch... They're gonna run into it. And that's what these dudes are for. Overwatch. I don't know if we'll be able to shoot through this thing. Limit it to that. We are the walls! We are the guns! Alright, we've still got a lot of plays to make here. On my and I think own. it starts with this. Should be a 100% dead Venom throw. Yeah, no problem. Alright. Now we can shoot this guy. It's not going to do a ton of damage. To the sky, brothers! But the question is, what can we... Heavy close support. Or where can we... Send these boys. Challenge accepted. That they can still do some damage to these venom probes. On our way. I don't know if they can shoot here with any efficiency. Engaging we'll try targets. though. We don't really have any other options.
Okay. And we have to shoot them. They shall know death. Damn, we didn't kill a didn't kill the model. That's what I wanted. That's not what happened. Of the assault doctrine. Let's look out here. Challenge accepted. The way Without we look there hesitation. probably doesn't matter much. Brother Arturo, man. Can only work on these guys, these types of units. Fear but this is why we got this ability. The great Angel Brothers. It is your right. We can boost uh, momentum, which is excellent. And we are also going to lay an Overwatch down here. They will protect Sister Verite a little bit, crumbs. perhaps. And I think that's it. Not a bad turn. I think the major threats were dealt with. It really all depends on how these guys behave. But passing through my zone of control. What a mistake. Excellent. Well, that was nice. And I fully expected, you know, double Venom Trope from this uh, direction as well. I was not, not blind to the fact that that would probably be there as well. The symmetry on this map uh, makes that very likely. And this is another one of those Thornbacks. So we need to watch this thing for a charge. I don't know if it can charge through a tank or anything like that. What I really, uh, the only thing I'd really be scared of is the, or the Exocrines who can one-shot my units out of nowhere. Ooh, they're gonna move the Hormagons back. The enemy thinks it can stay beyond our reach. Would make a lot more sense if they, uh, ooh, nice, pistol reaction attack. If they ran forward into my overwatches. I am the Sword of Sanguinius. Okay. Optimal range 2. Yeah, we don't want to give him any attacks. Hesitation. Gonna move here. Leave nothing but stains beneath our feet. That should kill them, correct? Okay, not quite. Close support. I want to get these things out of the way. So I can move past with Lieutenant Corleone. And beat these dudes in the face. Oh no, okay. I can't do it because I'm diagonal. Why didn't I learn this lesson before? And now I'm screwed. On God dang it. I was born. And should the Emperor win it, well, I've got to use double four, pistol now. I, sh I should have put him here. Okay, now we have to do this, which is not ideal. Oh, that so sucks. watches over us. Assault Marines ready. They're gonna get a chance to counterattack me. Uh, by the blood. I say, hopefully, it's not too devastating. Inceptors this was not this launch. was not well played. And also I kind of forgot about my speeder here. Let's move up. Should have 100 percent done that first. With speed. Move up. Not brilliant. Ready to strike. The thornback's gotta go though. Heavy armor, awaiting your orders. Now, Brother Quindar can make this happen. I'm kind of just me. thinking about how I want to leave space. Fire. Yeah, I don't, I don't care about his weak Overwatch. We are indomitable. Dang it! I did not leave room for this ball predator. I, I was thinking about leaving room for my we aggressors. Hmm. I see gene stealers here. I see the venom throats. We are the defenders of Ball. I think this is probably a good opportunity to peel this tank off. 
kind of plug this gap and you'll see we've made like a nice wall protecting ourselves 40% chance to hit is pretty garbage let's do this instead we want it to be in our optimal range so yeah I think we do that if we do the, if we put it out one further we lose some optim you know what no that's guarantee I think this is smarter we guarantee if it comes through here we shoot it no nope, you know what I kinda don't like that either because I want to protect myself from the gene stealers. All right, we've settled. We've settled on a strat. I will not fail. I don't think we shoot well from behind cover in this game. In, in other games we would be able to, but in this game death, it's not a thing. Vindication. Heavy fire support. We're just gonna protect our rear. For the Imperium. Okay, I need you guys to move out of the way first. Understood. Battle line squad ready. Let's get out of the way so I can move my other Hellblasters here. Because we're going to double Hellblaster the Thorn back. What needs uh, Brother Krogonax can heal. We took so little damage, though. Aye. We'll have you back up in no It's time. still good. It gives him momentum. Ranged plasma on your request. This might be a good opportunity to use supercharge because we have Brother plasma Arturo here. If one of these guys takes damage and they didn't, this is beautiful. Now, if this group takes damage, I've got the heal. Boom. Brother Arturo will come and heal them up. I go It'll be I next turn, it. but. That's a lot of damage on this Thornback. He's basically dead. Kind of hoping we can kill him with something not heavy in the front. You know what I mean? Alright, that sort of sucked. Let's just see what this does. Probably nothing. Dang, that was actually not bad. Not, not great. But not bad. Let's set our overwatches. Who tests my conviction? Set another overwatch. I defy their existence. Overwatch pretty damn strong in this area. Move you that away. The blood of Sanguinius right. flows in my veins. I know we can get this kill. Engaging the enemy. So I'm just going to take it with my intercessors that are the furthest away. I'm so aggravated right now. I could have popped battle line tactics and that might have got the kill. Engaging this is frustrating. But it's dead. All right, whatever. Mission accomplished. My vigilance is eternal. All right, let's nuke the Hormagaunts. Let's do this. Excellent. And I have no enemies in range here. Kill zone set. Forever watching. Okay. I should have way more Overwatch here than I do, but my guys whiff their turns. Heavy fire support. I think that's it. Would love to see a command point to help us clear some of the chaff. Alright, and this is why we set this. Holy crap! Okay, not bad, not bad. Sister Verity's Overwatch didn't go off? I'm counting on these gene stealers running in. All right, little annoying. Damn, they always do so much damage. I'm gonna give them the honors of getting the kill. 
No, and they're just gonna run away. The enemy's playing a little too smart. The enemy lurks in the shadows. Alright, I spoke too soon. They're gonna give me my sick overwatches. Holy crap! Alright, well that's terrible versus all of this uh, low tier infantry. We overwhelmed and suppressed them. Is that all? The melter gun would have been sick versus a thornback. I should have thought about that. We are the blood blades of Skyfall. My poor assault squad. I keep taking them just because I want them to do work, and they keep sort of disappointing me. Let's go. Yeah, I was about to say let's move. Let's move slowly. We've got optimal shots Lining here. Up. Anti -swarm firing All right. And we've On also got our free attack here. Damn, I love these things. They made them good in this game. Speed. All right. I am the sword of Sanctus. Brother? Brother. Wait, we might be able to move you guys over one more. Yes. Without good. hesitation. Then move you here. But we are just cleaning house on this flank. And without really the need to uh, hyper extend ourselves. Defensive zone set. I'm just going to move you dudes forward. And with that, we can easily push. We are the sons of Sanguinius. Just get this kill, please. Alright. With we that... Alright, cool. We're gonna push forward. I know the Venom Thropes are behind me, but we're gonna probably clean them up with these four. See what we can see. All right, we can't see anything. We are his shield, indomitable. Sister, let's move you here. Move Understood. you here. I'm looking we over here to see light. if anything pops out. Because if not, I can set an In Overwatch shadow, back here. I, find I don't think that's I quite far enough. Yeah, that's more of our optimal in range. In battle, liberation. In death, vindication. They shall never there walk in go. the Emperor's light. We Bring you up. Heal these the guys before I forget. Strong. Do not falter. Excellent. Can also give momentum. Can't give it to himself. I'm gonna give it to somebody. Brother Quindar, you move forward, please. There are the Gene Stealers. Predator crew ready. I'm gonna bring you guys out here. Um, I can get there, but then I won't have an Overwatch active. That might not be a big deal. I'm surprised there aren't more gargoyles on this map. The flyers. Um. I don't know. We'll set some crummy Overwatch there. They might. They might walk in that direction. The defense of Angelicum stands with you. Only in death. Will my duty be completed? Almost certainly a case of just setting Overwatch being the right move. We are the walls! We are the guns! Since there's really no enemies nearby, support ready. I'm gonna take this opportunity to move the my guys forward. Waits. I guess I'll even heal for the momentum. And then set my own Overwatch keep here. An eye out. And that's it. How close are we to using our command on points? On Balfora I was born. Very close. Should the Emperor win it, on Balfora I will die. Here we 
we go. Alright, that's one down. Yeah, a little annoying that they're trying to flank me. I wish they'd have just come up the pipe and we could have shot them to pieces. The Gene Sealer's falling back again and another Thornback coming in. It's got a ranged attack, but if it doesn't come closer, we're not going to get the Overwatch. And it looks like that's the case. If I'd have put double Overwatch on my Hellblaster, that might have been better. We would have got shots on that thing. Yeah, that was not a not a very useful series of attacks for these warriors. Half dead hormigants. More targets are coming. All right, we are we are downright surgical this episode, and I'm loving it. Before we deal with that, let's deal with this. Not even death will stop me. I want to see how much damage this thing does. The Xeno spines are for naught. Damn. I like it. Alright, if I do that, that means the Thornback, I can guarantee he's not going to get a counter attack. Which is why I did it. Destination confirmed. There we go. Let's keep moving aggressively forward. Remote four range. Let's move here. Rolling to position. Move it. Use the tank we as cover. See what we can do with that. <laughs> I think we can just kill them here. We lost sight of the warriors, that's alright. Yeah, later nerds. Little aggravated that this is these guys are kind of keeping me back. The blood of Sanguinius flows in my veins. We move can here. handle it. Let's move here. Bring Kroganax there. And then Brother Arturo, just forever behind. We'll use all of his movement My there. Never tires. So that's a lot of stuff. I think we might be able to get a good airstrike. Let's see. Something like that. Yeah, that was pretty sick. Good damage. Another thorn back. I think we just go for more Overwatch I wait your orders. with Brother Quindar. We could try shooting at these guys. Let's do it. Plasma on your request. Target acquired. I'm being a little greedy. I think Overwatch would be better. Go here. My duty remains. Order confirmed. Okay. Tech Marine, standing by. Bring Kroganax forward. Heal here. I'm gonna set Overwatch. If these warriors come around the corner, I wanna have that available. I'm aggravated because they're playing in this corner down here. And I don't want to have to go chase them. And I definitely don't want to chase them through the poison. 
So I'm going to make an executive decision here and just sort of ignore them. Always vigilant. Your command. I'm assuming they're going to continue on a path that leads them to me. They shall never walk in the Emperor's light. There we go, and we'll cover our back. We'll cover these two entrances here. Your orders. If these warriors want to come play in melee, they're going to have to we go are through the us. Walls. We are the guns! Frag storm it up. And that was okay. With strength. We don't have great shots there, but we have probably an okay overwatch, maybe. I feel like we're just going to hit the wall. Alright, we haven't moved any of these yet. Let's move a couple. Make sure there are no venom tropes hiding. I'm sure there's probably some more scary stuff out there. Can move one oh, more. Oh. All right. Victory for the blood blades. Victory for Skyfall. I can move forward. Let's move normal. Death from above. Always forwards. Set up an overwatch. And then we've got enough to do an overwatch again here. Alright. See what these warriors do. Yep, and they're just as suspected they're going to come in. God, they're being annoying. At some point, we might clear the entire front of the map and then have to turn around and, and deal with them. Okay. That's best case scenario for us. Kroganize can just fix that up, no problem. Do you not get a counterattack? Alright, they're moving to the other side. Yeah, and they're bringing some range to bear against me here. But I think we're going to be able to push up enough to help support these guys. And the Inceptors are very well armored and they have a lot of HP. And thankfully we haven't taken any damage yet. Okay, that, that hurts. Taking fire! Taking fire! Okay, not a huge deal. Really hoping they would come in and join the fight here. But instead they're just hit and run tactics. And the Gene Stealers still refuse to fight. AI is too good, man. It knows about Overwatch. And look at this. They're just like hoarding Gene Stealers back here. Well, if you don't ever engage, I don't ever have to I be worried about you. Adversary. And I'm sure there's some boss type thing back here. I want to pick off as much as I can before I get engaged with whatever the heck that is. Thornback's gonna go. If you're wondering why I don't always fast forward, it's because I'm actually thinking of strategies while they move. This is just, most of the time, it's just buying me time to think. Oh god, here's whatever it is. A Tervigon. Explains a number of gaunts we've been seeing. It's had all this time to birth its own defense force. The alien has converted Kemrenda into a fortified creche for the gene stealers. This is... 
More sophisticated than expected. Its reach is large, but it is not the Foundation node. We have yet to unmask the weaver of this network. Okay. Damn, we have so many options. Every turn is like jam-packed with stuff. Okay, not quite dead. Got it. Do something like this, though. Alright, excellent. And we'll see if I need to move them in the future, but that's one less dude. Turbagon. Big armor. Huge HP pool. He's no brother Quindar, but... Still... Put some fire down there. I know I want to do this, so let's we'll just do it. Up in no time. My All right. is eternal. And I think two hits from Brother Quindar will kill this thing. I must resist. Yeah, and we took some thorns damage. And a big counter attack, which is why I put some ranged attack on it. So we're going to take another thorns attack, but all we need is another heal from Brother Quindar. Uh, Kroganax. Everybody's a brother, guys. Alright, and because of that, now our tank, the ball predator, is still free to shoot. Let's take that. And say, man, if we got a kill off of that, that'd be sick. Order confirmed. With strength. I'm probably going to end up moving my aggressors all the way in. Deal some damage there first. Oh, I don't have any action point. Ooh, that's not good. I thought I had an attack here, but of course I used it on the thornback. I'm going to move in. Move here. With precision, brothers. Heavy fire support. See what I can do to these guys. I don't want warriors still here next turn if I can help it. Let's move there. Move up one. So much damage that does to the gene stealers. Almost one shot, that's excellent. Here. I'm not going down this alley. I'm going to shoot them and then do like a drive-by and just keep going. Yeah, like this. And it's going to be up to my intercessors to clean up this fight. Death to the Xenos Swarm. There we go. One less crew. For the Emperor. Very annoying. But also, not really doing anything. Let's move here. We're going to one-shot these Termagants. Thin their numbers. They will not overwhelm us. And that leaves these warriors pretty well unsupported. I am the Imperium's shield. We are the sisters of battle. Let's just move you as much as possible. Yeah, I mean we don't really have a shot. Sever the head so that the body will fall. It's not nothing. On Balfour, I Checking on my born. command point progress. The Emperor win it. On Balfour, I will die. I would love my fury will be fast. to jump in with Lieutenant Carleon and just smack this stupid thing in the face. Uh, we're just not there yet. It's probably going to be next turn. The Sanguinary Priesthood serves the will of the chapter. 
Brother Krognax. Let's bring Brother Krognax here. Heavy armor, awaiting your orders. Because you can't fight in melee. My axe couldn't bisect. Can also bring up Brother Arturo to heal Brother Krogonax. Let's let him smack these guys. He'll get some kills. They will probably be able to attack him back. The blood will heal him. I've had worse. Yeah, not terrible. And then we'll use this, which allows us to use surge. The power. Of the Omnisire. Beautiful. Warriors down. I almost started singing. This is how we, we do it. This is how we do it. My vigilance is eternal. The fun part is the sha na 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 na. You know what I'm talking about. I. I get stoked whenever we make a good play, or at least an okay play. Uh, damn, look at all the dead bodies we left in our wake. Still not good enough, though. In righteous battle, liberation. In I'm just going to turn this way just to keep an eye on the Venom Thropes. I'd like to see where they're going. Yeah, we still have the Hellblasters, though. Never fear. We could almost certainly finish off that Gene Stealer and almost certainly finish off this one. Let's move up here. As uh, much as I'd like to put some damage on the Turvagun... We gotta get to it. We gotta clear out all this garbage. Alright, nice. Move forward an additional point. If this thing is walking around like birthing uh, these gene stealers, I'm gonna be pretty aggravated. Because there are a lot of freaking gene stealers on this map. Who hasn't attacked? Okay. We still have to make moves on this flank. Sanguinius watches over us. And these moves are going to be pretty important. For Sanguinius! Their death is our only option. I like this. I like this series of movements here. Um, I think... We fight these dudes the in melee. Has no right to live. See what kind of damage we do. Death from above. We finish them, finish them. And then... Uh, I mean, do I shoot at this? Probably, right? Would have been a lot cooler if we got the other kill. Let's see if we can get both of them, though. Nice. I mean, hey, that's a good turn. On that was three. Own. That was three dead units. Close combat support. Let's make sure we watch our flank. Ready. Got it. And we'll be ready to take the fight to the Turvagon this coming turn. Sanguinius watches over us. Yeah, everyone looks good. Brother Quindar, have you maxed out your movement? You have. Ready to strike! Alright, let's see what these dudes do. I'm not sure if we're going to have to kill every unit on the map this time, or if just killing the Turvagon is going to be enough to give us what we need. Will they shoot me? I Looks like something. no. Okay, I'm happy with that. I'd rather not get attacked. Yeah, fully expecting my assault assault squad to get wrecked. Okay, will they give a little bit back though? No. Oh yeah, bring it, bring it to the thunder hammer. Okay, okay, okay. It has a region. Uh, don't like that. Won't help you if I can kill him in one turn though, which I may be able to do. So many melee guys. I'm a little worried for my Dreadnought. 
We can go heal it. There's just so many dudes. Okay. Oh no. We lost our fear hill so dreadnought. We have been engaged. I got an achievement and the explosion was pretty sick. It killed them all. And we didn't get a pistol reaction shot. I man, I guess I don't understand this. Maybe it's only in Overwatch? I thought anyone attacking us from the front would get a pistol reaction shot. That Dreadnought was one of our more experienced ones too. Not that it truly matters. I don't think it has any gameplay benefit to like keeping all your units alive. I don't think that's a thing. Maybe it affects bonus tokens or something like that. Maybe if you don't lose a unit you get a bonus token. Maybe if you do it in a certain speed you get a bonus token. I have no idea. If you'd be willing to, guys, if you ever, you know, want to help me out, feel free to look that stuff up. I'm so damn busy in real life, I forget to to do stuff like that. Alright, optimal range four. We actually need to back up if we're gonna shoot this thing. We but will let's, fall upon them with let's do some of that. Alright, that kinda sucked. Let's get the kill here. Are you kidding me? Come on, guys. Well, they just sort of screwed me. See what we can bring it down to. Alright. Thunderhammer. Amount of Carapace will save this abomination. And then Thunderhammer again. Ooh, even less damage that time. But I have to imagine I can do a hundred. Somehow, some way. Past, future. Let's move There's up only here. Service to the Emperor. They cannot stop Make some me. room for other units. Damn, that doesn't do much of anything. It's got too much too much armor. I've got to get into melee on it. Which is fine. I think Brother Quindar in two hits kills this thing. Maybe even one hit. Oh no. Oh no. Okay. Well. A few numbers here and there and this thing is already dead. With a command point earned... Unfortunately, I can't use this because I've used all my action points. But now we've got to corral this stuff. We should back up here, I think, or else we're just going to die. Accepted. Oh, no. I well, I'm an absolute, absolute fool. I don't know why I thought I could do that. My bad. Tried to save them, but On I didn't respect four, zone of control. And should the Emperor win it on Ball Uh Okay. I think I'm just getting, like, brain fatigue. On my way. Let's go heal Brother Quindar. These are Termagants. I'm not scared of Termagants. My power is yours to command. Smack those. This mission has forced me to respect the damage potential of gene stealers. Frag them. Love it. Just get that kill. This 
move here. Shoot here. Get a couple of them, move up one. See if we can't finish. We are the walls! We are the guns! We carry divine vengeance. See what we can do with our blessed ammo. Target engaged. Excellent. In Catherine's footsteps. This is going to do nothing. But I'm going to try anyway. Oh no, it did something. Try that out. We've got an action point here, but we can't really use it. What a sacrifice. What a heroic death. Okay. Predator crew ready. When the day is darkest, we prevail through control. We still have actions here, I think. Maybe not. <laughs> no, we do, we do, we have some actions. I think we can probably kill this group of gene stealers with just Brother Arturo swinging his chainsaw. My chainsaw thirsts for their blood. Yeah, and that should be easy kills. Moving into position. Fire support. You guys Target shoot this acquired. way. My vigilance is eternal. Man, I lost two units this battle. Not proud of that. I'm just going to pin them in. Give them another target. I don't think any damage we take at this point matters. We can see all three units that are currently arrayed the against us. Waits. We're taking fire. Speed this up. I'm not that ashamed of my Furioso Dreadnought loss. It got swarmed pretty heavily. I just didn't give it enough protection. But I am ashamed of my stupid, poor movement. Wow, I didn't expect him to take that much. I didn't think it would do great, but like, that's a lot of damage. Death from above! Please shoot there. Oh, okay. Only thing that's left now... The warriors. Order confirmed. Forward. Sister? Firing? That made finish this. And indeed the it does. The leader is vanquished. Another node of the network darkens. Him render restored and five bonus objectives completed. Clean all of this up. I fear your mighty salt fort may not be habitable for some time, Lieutenant. They will persist, sister. The people of the salt always do. As long as they have somewhere to come back to, then we have done all that we can for them. Uh, not my finest. I thought we were doing great. We, when we stayed high and tight, we were doing great. But as soon as we started to kind of flare out um, and chase a little bit, yeah, we got we got overextended. We just needed to stay balled up. But for me, that's a little boring. I like being aggressive. We have new units. We have the librarians. I was hoping it'd give me one to use in the battle, so I could kind of test it out. I feel like by the time I get some of these units, it's like too late. Um, do I have reserves? Sure. Let's bring this guy in, and then we lost one of those. Go back to units under command. My reserves, units under command. Okay, who will I get rid of? 
I really don't like... I want to have one of everything, but I think these assault guys suck. Hmm. The sisters aren't all that great either. Maybe I just bring one of them. As like a bodyguard unit. Let's bring a librarian. I'm stoked for a librarian. Is restless. How much do you cost? 210 points? Okay, you better have some good abilities. Four sword and master crafted bolt pistol. Good HP. I don't know if you count as an HQ unit. Maybe. Let's look at its ability. Summons a vision of Sanquinius that terrifies all enemies who see it, does 20 momentum damage to all enemy units within two tiles, and 18 to 25 psychic damage to all enemy units within one tile. Okay. Let's go see if we can upgrade them. I've got 13 points. Does anything else that I've, like, unlocked help them out? Hmm. Death from above is something that I do want at some point. Q units, yes, we've done that. It's for Hell Blasters. Make them better. Librarians. Okay. Force Harmonicus. Bonus melee accuracy and damage by 5%. That doesn't seem very good. This blade is more than an extension of your arm. It shall be an amplifier of your will. Only in death. Will my duty be completed? Then we get Angel's Foresight, which gives plus 10 evasion. I like that a little bit better. The briefest glimpse can mean the difference between a bolt through the shoulder or through the head. Past, future, there is only service to the Emperor. Okay, and then we can spend another four to give them Psychic Fortress, 40 HP per model. A librarian's mind is a stronghold from which the body derives vigor. I thought it was going to say something about the doors unbarred and unguarded. It's a little throwback. And then lastly, Wings of Sanguinius. Affects casting unit. Okay, so it does it to itself. Enables jump movement mode. Plus two movement. Ignores movement costs and traversability penalties. So he can give himself like a jump pack. Glistening Wings of the Great Angel spring forth to carry the Librarian forward. And then lastly, the ability that we probably want to get. The one that makes him almost certainly more useful. Is the Blood Lance. If I had one more, I would probably just rush this. Throws a lance that damages all enemies on the way to the target. Maximum range 2. Deals a bunch of splash damage and armor piercing. Okay, a spear made of empiric energy in the blood of his fallen enemies. I like this. Only in death will my duty be completed. Let's hook him up. And I've been wanting to know whether or not this affects uh, our brother Quindar. Giving the extra HP to that. So there we go. All points spent. And we are ready for the next battle, guys. Thank you so much for watching. My name is Brett, channel's Good Talk Gaming. And as always, I'll see you in the next one. Take care, y'all.